results. But in focus on your health, Teresa Snow shows us how researchers at the University of Missouri are working to make the process faster and cheaper. Focus on your health is sponsored by MU Healthcare. Researchers at MU believe that hormone testing will one day be done at a nurse's station or even from the privacy of your home with the help of a cell phone. Right now, testosterone testing requires blood work and a lab. It's a lengthy and expensive process. A lot of people don't go without testing because you can afford it or the timing takes too much time to get the result back. The testing is necessary to monitor patients receiving testosterone therapy. But a team of researchers at the University of Missouri is developing a better way to measure those levels. They call it the T-meter. Your measurement is going to be more reliable and more stable and we believe um, a lot more, uh, more accurate. Think of it like a glucose meter used by people with diabetes. But instead of sugar, this mobile device will measure testosterone levels in a patient's blood. You uh, make a small pinch in your finger, have a small drop of blood, sweat the, the sensor, incubate for one or two minutes, wash it in the tap water, put in the read, in the reading unit, and push a button in your phone. The finished product will include test strips that absorb the hormone and change color. The shift in color is read with a unit plugged into your cell phone. The goal of the T-meter is instant results at a fraction of the price. A lot more accessible, yes, you're talking uh, maybe $400 currently is the cost for your free testosterone versus maybe $10, $20. Giving patients results at the touch of a button. The T-Meter team recently received funding through the University of Missouri's Coulter Translational Partnership Program. The grant is meant to help them take their idea from research to market. With Focus on Your Health, I'm Teresa Snow. Focus on Your Health has been sponsored by MU Health.